Hello everyone, thank you for watching my channel. Today we are doing a beachy wave tutorial. So if you want to see how I came up with these luscious locks, this luscious style, this luscious, can I think of another adjective? I'm showing you how to achieve a fun, casual, or dressy, however you want to do it, beachy wave hair tutorial. And for my hair, it's a little short, it has a little A-line stacked, messy cut, which is what I prefer right now. But this can also be very versatile for longer hair, all varieties of hair. My hair is naturally curly, so I actually straightened it before and then you'll see the whole process. Trust me. So if you want to see how this look came together, then keep watching. So now, are you prepared to see what this hair naturally does after I wash it? If you think wearing no makeup is vulnerable, Hi there. This is my hair. I wash it, go to sleep, and this is what happens when I wake up. Lion's mane. <sighs> so here I am brushing through my hair. I might need to mean ooh, and that love oh spray it quick. When people say they want curls, this is what they're asking for. Why? So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to straighten my hair. But before I do that, I'm going to use the Chi 44 Iron Guard. This will help protect my hair from heat. I've got some horror stories from using, this is really low, I need to get some more. Use whatever brand you're happy with. Anything is better than nothing. And I want you to make sure that you don't have, I don't care how curly your hair is, if you have it on the highest setting, you're gonna fry your hair. Learn from my mistake, please. Cause my hair was so fried, you could have dipped it in ketchup. You know what I'm saying? It was a French fry, I could have eaten it. From right above my ears, I'm going to straighten it. Actually, I don't need to do this in the tutorial. I'm just gonna, you know what? And it's straight. So now that my hair is straight, you know what? We're gonna just do it the easy way. And snap! Oh. You knew I was kidding. Okay, we're gonna go into the beachy wave curl. Are you ready for some waves? I've done different approaches to the beachy wave, but I'm using the one inch hot tools this is about $25, I got it off of Amazon. Um, you can get different widths depending on your preference. For me, I did the one inch. I do have it not at the highest setting, I have it halfway at about, at about 350 degrees. The brownies will turn out great. And while that is warming up or heating up to a really, really hot temperature, I'm going to divide my hair. My hair is, I have a lot of hair and it's pretty thick, so I have to do this in sections. So I'm gonna use my little clippy and I divide my hair. And this is an example of my mom saying that my hair looks severe. You know, and I'm from Texas, we like it big, big old hair. So I'm gonna grab about, from the back, a, about a one inch piece of hair. And this is the part I'm gonna be super careful. But I hold it down and I wrap it just around the wand. And I don't hold it there for too long and I hold this piece out. You want it to not be a perfect curl. Squeeze a little bit because it's still warm. If it's too hot to where you touch your hair and it burns your hand, that's too hot for your hair. So I'm gonna to continue to do that through the rest of my hair, just little one inch pieces. And I'm going to change it to where it um, alternates sides. I think I did the same direction, but I'm gonna change directions as I go. finish the first area of hair, the first layer, I just lightly spray it, very lightly. I bet you're wondering what heavily means. And then I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to split another section 
Ouch. And we will curl it the same way. Little one inch pieces, not too hot. So as you see, you already see kind of the theme here. It's a little tousled, beachy wave, but more put together look. And it's one of my favorite do's, hair do's. So we're going to split where I normally part my hair and do these two sections, and then you'll see the finished product. Wink, wink. Do the final. No, this is not a setting spray. This is a hairspray. I need one of those little masks. Okay, what I'm going to do is just kind of shake it out because we don't want it to be really defined curly whirlies. We want it to look a little PC. Is it an American thing to just add E to everything? It's very lighty in here and brighty, and my hair is so wavy and pinky lipstick and bluey and mixed with mixed with a little greeny and my sorry my shirt is a little blacky but i just thought it would go good with my it would go well with my bluey background so thank you yui anyway we're gonna shaky my hairy my hairy and then after you my hair is naturally curly so it wants to be frizzy when i run my fingers through it we're gonna do something interesting. I'm gonna flip my head over and we're gonna flip it back. Okay, so this is the natural part that I do. And you're starting to get the fill. I'm gonna do a quick hair setting spray. Oh, come on, again. So this is the final look. You can see in the sides. This side, hi, and this side, hey there. And also, if there's little pieces that you want to have a little more defined, just keep using this. But for now, I think I'm done did. You know what I'm saying? So this is how you do it. I hope you like it. So anyway, I hope you like this tutorial. Thank you so much for watching, and make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't. You won't regret it, I'm telling you. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye. Snap! The job's a game! Just a spoonful of sugar helps the medicine go down. The medicine go down. Medicine go down. You knew that was coming. Don't even act like you didn't. Okay. Don't you even start flickering, you light. Oh my. I can't do it. I can't do that. We're going to shake it a little bit, make it a little more. 
Ooh, that was the most disgusting sound. If only I could find a way to get rid of these roots. Let's see. Ugh. 